Hey guys, welcome back. In these next few videos, we would like to run you through the updates that we have made to the Link app for the new Addis update. Let's begin. In this video, we will be discussing the manual selection function. This is a new option that can be selected when opening the profile selector tab. The purpose of this function is to allow users a new way to get the power curve recommendation for the specific profile pack they have selected that they want to utilize. This differs from the new sample entry function that recommends all information for you based on what the algorithm believes is most suitable for the sample that is being roasted. We believe this new feature is perfect for a new user who wants to explore the different profile packs to understand their particular taste preferences. It will assist a more experienced user familiar with the link system who wants to experiment with alternative roast theory's impact on taste. Manual mode will now allow a cupping lab or queue see facility that has worked out certain roast preferences they would prefer to use in their assessments. A way to bypass the new sample entry recommended profile pack selections. Lastly, it makes it easier for the competitor to dictate which roast plan they want to emulate their competition preparations to. With the new manual selection mode, the possibilities from this function are endless and open the door for users to explore all the profile styles whilst being guided to the correct power curves, fan adjustments, and development percent needed to achieve a successful roast. A good thing to note here is that like the new sample entry, manual selection allows all the new extra preference selections to also be used in the solutions algorithm when activated. Let's open up the app and give a quick demonstration of the manual selection. When all additional preferences are turned off, the first thing we will see when opened is a prompt to ask us which roast style we want to explore. Today, let's select filter. When selected, we will now see that the next prompt asks us which profile pack we would like the solution to populate from. Today, we would like to select filter E. Then we proceed to fill in our volume by weight density and process, and we'll click Done. On the Solutions page, we will see the profile pack we selected, the power curve for that selection 206, suggested development percent 12 to 14 percent, fan action, and expected first crack is estimated to occur between 6 minutes and 5 seconds to 6 minutes and 25 seconds. Let's see how this solution population would look for a different filter pack when using the same coffee, which is a natural process and has a 65 gram density. Here we see for profile pack filter D, power curve 203 is recommended. The suggested development is 9 to 11 percent. We still increase the fan by the same amount, and we see a much later expected first crack. It is important to take away from this demonstration that each profile pack may require a different approach of power and settings, even when using the same coffee to have an optimized result. With manual selection mode, the link algorithm now has you covered, allowing fluid movement between any roast style you wish to explore. And that is a wrap. As always, happy roasting.